This is not just an ordinary boat on the Seine River. Its trip is short but highly symbolic. The organizers of the boat ride want to show support for the flotilla which is on its way from Turkey to Gaza. This afternoon we are in Paris, we are uh, on a boat and we are uh, showing that uh, something has to be done to break the siege uh, of the Gaza Strip. Such support for the flotilla is pouring in from different countries and they know Israel has blocked similar flotillas in the past. Tel Aviv says it will block the flotilla as soon as it enters the 20-mile exclusion zone Israel maintains off Gaza's coast. But these supporters believe, if successful, the mission would be of great help to the Gazans, who are in need of almost every essential item since Israel imposed a blockade in 2008. Gaza was badly damaged by the war that year, and almost nothing has been reconstructed, as Israel allows only a handful of goods through the restricted borders. Many of these supporters have been in Gaza and other occupied Palestinian territories. Such steps have been welcomed by lawmakers as well, both in the EU Parliament in Strasbourg and in the French Parliament in Paris. La position de, du gouvernement français, mais aussi en général des pays occidentaux, est assez complexe. C'est toujours des positions très ambiguës. En même temps, euh, on a l'air de dire qu'on veut la paix. Et donc, pour vouloir la paix, ça veut dire soutenir le droit international, les résolutions, et euh, soutenir euh, ben, la, les Palestiniens qui revendiquent leur État. Mais de l'autre côté, on continue à soutenir Israël. Or, on sait qu'Israël ne veut pas la paix. Figures from around the world prove one fact though. The longer it takes for world powers to help Gaza, the higher the number of initiatives from ordinary citizens to carry out humanitarian aid. MPs in the West who support the flotilla are few, but some of them, like Ali Maboumoudine Thierry, have now started saying that if Israel blocks the flotilla, they will try to get themselves airdropped onto the ships. And it's to Pry Press TV, Paris.